Hi guys, it's Emily. Um, I am currently at my apartment. My apartment has a little studio in it, which I'm very lucky to have. Um, but I'm going to be filming a ballet class or a ballet bar, maybe a little center for block one, ballet one. Um, I really miss you and I'm sad we're not in the studio together, but I'm happy that we get to do this. Um, the way I'm going to film, I'm going to demonstrate once, um, kind of talking it out and teaching the combinations, and then um, I will demonstrate it with the music, and then you will do the other side. I'm only going to do one side, um, just kind of for the sake of time and, and uh, not to get the video too long. So, that being said, if you have any questions, let me know. You can use... Whatever music you want, I will post a Spotify link to the playlist that I'm going to use today. Um, it's kind of what we use in class anyways. Um, so with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys, we're going to start off with just some releves facing the bar um, to kind of get your feet warm and your body where it needs to be. So we're going to go ahead and start facing the bar in parallel. The music starts five six, seven, two fingers, eight. You can use a countertop, you can use whatever kind of bar you wanna use. You can do this in the center, um, however is going to be best for you. Um, again, I'm lucky I have a bar, but, so we'll start five, six, arms to first, seven, two fingers on whatever bar, eight. Plie, one. And stretch, elevate, squeeze to low. Again, five and six, up seven and eight. Third time, one and two, up three and four. Press over, five, up six, lower seven to first eight. Again, one and a two, three and four. Really squeezing those rotators, five and six, up seven, and eight, one, and two, up three, and four, press over, five, and six, lower seven, same thing in second, one, and two, up three, down four, five, and six, up seven, down eight, third time, and two, up three, and four, press over, and six, and seven, time back to first, We'll rise up, give a quick little balance, and then lower and finish. Okay, next we're gonna do plies. Again, you'll be facing the bar. Um, and one thing I want you to make sure of is making sure your knees are going right over your toes. You're holding your center nice and tight and really thinking about wrapping those glutes, squeezing those rotators, all of the things that we normally talk in ballet class. I want you to 
make sure that you're thinking about all of that on your own. So you'll start in first, the music starts five and six, arms to first, seven, two fingers, three, a one, and a stretch, two, and stretch, three, and stretch, time, do two seconds, one, stretch, two, and stretch, three, and stretch, time, do two fifths, one, and stretch, two, and stretch, three, and stretch, time, do back to first, plie, releve, three, and four, and five, and six, squeeze down seven, other side, Next thing we're gonna do are tendus. Tendu means to stretch. So make sure that you're really stretching through your legs and maintaining your turnout. Facing the bar. In first, the music starts. Five and six, arms to first, seven, two fingers, eight. Hand and tendu to the front, one. Flex it, two and three. Toes back, four. Heel forward and six. Again, seven, plie, eight. On quad side and the flex and time and close out and in and out with the plie to the back flex time to long leg back there five and six seven plie again one and the flex time to and close out and in and out other side so we'll do the other side and then we will repeat in fifth. So, in fifth, one, and flex, and time, two times. One goes to plie, to the side, and flex, time, close back, out, close front, out with the plie, toes back, flex, time, and out, and out with the plie, side, Flex, time to close, out and close and out with the plie. Yes? And then you'll go to the other side.
Okay, next we're gonna do degages, almost like we do tendus, um, but we're gonna do them starting in fifth. So, they're a little different, pretty similar. In fifth, music starts six, seven, eight, and then the tendu, one. Lift it two. I'm gonna do this facing the bar because it's a little close, or facing you. So in fifth, six, seven, eight, time do one, lift it two, time do three, close four, out and in, out and in, to the side, one, lift, three, close four, out and in, and out, and into the back, one, lift, three, close four, out and in, out and in to the side, one, lift, time you close, out, in, seven, eight, and finish. And then you'll pause and repeat on the other side. Okay, so going back to the degages, normally I would have you facing your bar or your counter or your bedside table or whatever, um, but my legs didn't fit, so just keep that in mind. Um, we're gonna do ronde jambes next. Make sure that when you're doing your ronde jambes, you're keeping your circle as big as you possibly can. Uh, ronde jambes is also one of my favorite ballet steps. Just, it really gives you a chance to open up those hips and work the muscles. Um, and I just, it's one of my favorites. So, you're gonna be facing the bar. In a nice first position, you're really wrapping those legs, holding those rotators. All of the things that we talk about in class, your pelvis is lifted, your arms are down. Music starts six and seven and eight. You're gonna turn to the front, one. Carry it to the side, two. To the back, three. Close, four. Again, five. And six. And seven. And eight. Third time, one. And two. Really full circle to the back, three. And four. Coupe to the front, five. Passe, six. Coupe, seven. Lower, eight. Then you'll reverse. Back. Full side, all the way to the front, and first, and five, and six, and seven, eight, again, one, two, three, and four, coupe to the back, five, passe six, and seven, and eight, and then you'll go into the other side. So you'll pause and repeat, or just keep on going. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna do at the bar are your padres, coupe padre. 
hula hoop, back, side, front, and back, side, front. We're gonna add some passes in as well, or retires as well. The difference between a retire and a passe is a retire closes exactly where it came from. A passe switches sides. So keep that in mind. You're gonna start with your right foot in the front, in fifth. The music starts six and seven, two fingers, eight. One, two, three, four, two, three, five. Pavre six, seven, eight, three times. One, two, three. From here, susu four, retire, five, six, close down, seven, back to susu eight. Coupe, one, two, three, four, coupe, five, six, seven, eight, third time, one, two, three, four, you're gonna stay up, I can't stay up on this foot, five, six, back to a susu, seven, eight, one, sorry, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, up, six, so you'll do this as many times as you want, at least right, left, right. I'm gonna show the right, and I'm gonna do the best on my left. Um, you guys already know that it's hard for me to stand on that left foot, but um, here we go. Okay, so we're gonna do Grand Batma. Um, what I want you to think about when you're doing Grand Batma is really kicking from underneath, slight under curve, and not brushing and kicking your legs too high to knock you off your center. I want to know that you're focusing on keeping your hips very even, very still. So if I were to just look at you from the waist up, I would not know that you were moving on the bottom. They're gonna be very similar to the degage combinations, just a little bit bigger. So, in first position, the music starts. Five and six and seven and eight. You're gonna time to one. Lift to two and three and four. Time to five. Scoop it under. Seven and eight. Same thing to the side. One and out and down, first, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, to the back, again, just at nine, two, and three, and four, and five, six, seven, and eight, to the side, two, three, four, and five, six, and seven, and finish. And then you will pause, and repeat on the other side.
couple times and then start over. Um, but we're going to work on tombe pas de gray. So tombe, just as a reminder, means to fall. And then your pas de gray goes back, side, front. So the first, we're going to do two combinations with it. The first combination I'm going to give you, we're going to tombe pas de gray into fifth. So you're going to start with your right foot in the front. The music starts six and seven and eight. You're going to tombe one, pas de gray, to fifth, two, passe, three, close back in the front, four, and five, pas de gray, six, passe in the front, seven, close, eight, and uh, one. I'm running out of space. Pas de gray, to fifth, two, passe, three, close, four, try it four times, five, pas de gray, six, and the seventh, close eight. I'll start further back so I don't run out of room. Um, what I want you to focus on is really letting your weight transfer from one foot to the other and then your pas de gray. Back, side, front. I would like to see you lower down straight legs and then really scoop that passe up and close nice tight fifth in the front. And then you'll just do the same thing four times on the right foot four times on the left foot. Here we go. Maybe you can work on it while we're not at the studio, and then when you come back, we can all do it together. So, again, you're going to start with the right leg. Not too much different. Six and seven and eight. You're going to tombe one, pas de gré to fourth, two. So I'm bending two legs. Tom three, close four. Now you're on the other leg. Left leg. Five and a fourth. Six, time seven, eight, and one, and a two, three, close four, last time, five, and a, sorry, six, seven, and eight. So, I'll back it up and I'll show it one more time, just so you can see, right and then left, seven, Eight, tombe one, pas de gray to fourth, two. Tom do three, close four. Tom do five, or pa, sorry, tombe pas de gray, six. Tom do seven, close eight. Um, I will demonstrate right and left. You can do it as many times as you want. Um, again, to whatever music you want. I'm just using ballet music because it's what I do. Um, Really, really, really go nice and slow. Back, side, front. When you go to fourth, make sure you're bending on two legs and your heels are on the floor. So it's different from a jazz pier. Okay, last thing we're gonna do are some change mas. Um, I'm gonna make them a little tricky for you, that way you can practice and when you come back, you will be good to go and we can work on them um, all together. 
So again, changement goes from fifth to fifth. You're gonna do three. So music starts six and seven, eight, three changements. A one, a two, a three. A one, a two, a three. And a one, and two, and three. And a one, and two, and three. Finish. You can do that as many times as you want. So you're gonna hold the fourth. One and two and three, four. 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 Just to see, I think it'll be something fun for you to kind of practice at home and then show us when you come back to the studio. So that is it. Um, something to think about when you do your changemas, getting a nice fifth position when you plie, actually plieing and getting your knees over your toes and really straight legs and pointed feet in the air. Um, and I'm really excited to see you guys come back and, and practice that one with me. Um, another thing, fun thing that you can do is, you know, take a sibling or a parent if they're up for it, and chasses. Getting those feet nice and high up in the air, chasse around the house, around the living room, couch, um, kitchen table, kitchen island, dining room, wherever you, wherever you think you can fit them in, um, that would be a good way to end your class. Um, and then the other thing I would ask you to do is set a timer. It can be a timer on a phone, a watch, um, wherever you have a timer, a parent, and set it for two minutes and do your splits, your right split, your left split, and your middle split. Um, but anyways, I had so much fun doing this video for you and I hope you enjoy it. Um, I can't wait to see you guys back in the studio. I already miss you. And, um, Hopefully, you know, we'll see each other soon. If you have any questions about anything at all, leave, the, leave a comment. We'll do our best to keep up with those. And again, I will link the Spotify playlist in the, down at the bottom, but you can do whatever music you want or no music, or you can use the music on the video, whichever you prefer. Um, but I can't wait to see you and hopefully we'll see each other soon.